Systemic failures and poor decision making is just a bit of the conclusions of an initial report regarding the elementary school shooting in Texas in May. Lily Luciano is there with more on the report, including new body cam footage. And we want to warn you, some of the video you're about to see is disturbing. Body cam footage of police in Uvalde, Texas, show the chaos at Robb Elementary as a gunman killed 19 children and two teachers on May 24th. Dude, we gotta get in there. We gotta get in there. He keeps shooting. Eva Mireles was one of the teachers killed. Her husband, school police officer Ruben Ruiz, was among those in the hallway. That's my wife's classroom. Despite the initial urgency, officers did not enter the classroom for over an hour. Please put your gun down, sir. A 77-page report released Sunday called the response lackadaisical and said they failed to prioritize saving innocent lives over their own safety. Hey, what was that? In the room full of the report did not find any villains other than the gunman and found the response was caused by a lack of leadership, adding that it is plausible some victims could have survived if officers acted sooner. We have a lot to say. At a special school board meeting Monday night, parents demanded accountability, including the resignation of the superintendent and a new police force. You need to clean house. You need to start from zero. Rachel Martinez has four children in the district. Like other parents at the meeting, she says she's ready to keep her kids out of school this fall unless there are changes. My daughter Layla is so terrified of the thought of having to return to school in just a few short weeks that she comes to tears. Uvalde's mayor says as many as three officers have resigned since the shooting. Lilia Luciano, CBS News, Uvalde, Texas.